good morning everyone uh, this is vrushali dhanokar and today in this session we will learn the simple practical of embedded c programming language that is addition of two numbers so this practical included in pune university second year information technology 2019 pattern syllabus and the practical name is programming skill development lab so for addition of two numbers purpose we have to use embedded c programming language and the software is mplab ide v8.89 and the compiler is mplab c18 so let's see here okay now uh, see here this is a mplab uh, ide so before start the execution or before start the practical the first step is you have to create a one folder okay so you have to create this folder anywhere in uh, your computer or in your laptop so here i have created a one folder addition demo supports okay so i have created this folder in e drive and the folder name is addition demo now just to go to mplab id so first you have to create a one project so just click on project project wizard and click on next so here the next thing is you have to select a device okay so what particular microcontroller mention in your program you have to select that microcontroller so here for addition purpose i am using pic 18f45500 microcontroller so i am selecting this microcontroller but here all the pic 18 series microcontrollers are given so you can choose as per your project requirement so here i am choosing here pic 18f4550 now click on next so after clicking on next the next step is select a language tool suit so you have here i have selected microchip c18 compiler this compiler is already installed on my system okay so here mplab c18 c compiler so just choose this particular compiler and click on next now you have to choose a project file path okay so just click on browse button and gives the particular path here that you have already created the folder for example e drive and here i have already created the folder addition demo okay so just select this folder and here mention the name of your main or parent file for example addition 1 okay and the extension of that file is .mcp so this is your mplab ide project file this is a parent file means all the other files that is .c .hex .asm this all files are included in this particular file okay so just consider that this is your main file or root file so that is addition 1 .mcp and click on save right so see here the path is all mentioned here that is e drive we have created a folder additional demo and our file name is addition 1 and click on next so we don't have any existing files right we have we will create a new project here so just click on next now see here it shows the complete summary of the particular project that is device pic 18f4550 tool suit is microchip c18 that is our compiler and the location of that particular file so just click on finish right so here uh, we have created our project now the next step is you have to create a dot c file that is our programming file so just click on file and new so after click on file and new here is a new file window is open so here i am just uh, i have the code of addition of two numbers so i am just using this same code yes now see here this is a simple program of addition of two numbers in embedded c programming language so here first time save the particular file so here uh, control s for save purpose and my file name is suppose add 1 okay and save this file in similar folder that is e drive addition demo okay and give the file name that is dot c so it necessary to mention the extension of file that is dot c and just click on save okay now see here in this program this is a simple hexadecimal addition program first you have to import the files 
So here stdio.h that is standard input output and standard library. These two files are included in C programming language as well. <coughs> so these files are used for handling different libraries, different uh, variable initializations purpose. Okay. Now next step is you have to import the microcontroller files that is hash include p18f 4550.h and the same microcontrollers we have selected at the time of creating project so wait so these three are our header files and these files we have imported now the next step is uh, wait a minute okay now the next step is the main function every program will start from the main function this is the first function that will be executed now for addition purpose you have to declare one variable that is integer sum and initialize the value of sum is equal to zero okay now here addition logic is there you have to perform the addition of hexadecimal numbers right so that is 0x 0a plus 0x 02 so our pick microcontroller is a 8-bit microcontroller that's why 8 bits are mentioned here okay in in hexadecimal format a is means a particular value is 10 okay 0 to 9 after that a to e so a means 10 and 10 plus 2 means 12 so this 12 value is stored into this variable sum <coughs> after that there is a trace d equal to 0 so generally in a pic 18 microcontroller every pin is work as a bidirectional purpose means the pin is work as an input pin as well as output pin so this trace d register decide that whether the particular pin is work as an input or output so here trace d equal to 0 means a particular port d pin is work as a output pin right because this port d pin show the output of our addition right so this is a output pin <coughs> and that's why trace d equal to 0 mention here if it is input pin so at that time trace d equal to 1 mention here okay and every and the sum of the addition program is stored into this port d register so first header file declaration or import header files then main function then variable declaration and initialization then logic of addition program and after that declaration of registers so because in microcontroller every value is stored into the register so this is a add one dot c file <coughs> after that you have to add this file into the microcontroller right so here see here there is a source file option so just right click add file and here you have to add this dot c files okay that we have already created and the click on open see here here add one dot c this file is included into your source file okay and this is our root file that is dot mcp so just click on build all yes see here after clicking build all it shows the notification build succeeded okay and if there was any errors in program so at that time it shows build fell <coughs> so in this way we have build our program and the notification is build succeeded now you have to execute the program or run the particular program so see here click on project then sorry click on debugger then select tool then click on MPLAB sim okay after that click on view and see here there is option special function register so now see here these are the various registers are present in microcontroller okay now you have to run your program so for run purpose you have to use directly f9 key okay so just click on that see here at the left side at the bottom it shows the running or execution so microcontroller uh, program or embedded c program doesn't stop automatically you have to stop the particular program so for that purpose just click on f5 button okay so f5 button generally used for to stop the running this particular execution so just click on f5 okay now see here after stop the particular program see uh, where is our port D 
yes see this is our port d and this is the addition value 0 x 0 c so in our program a means 10 okay plus 2 10 plus 2 means 12 c c equal to 12 c is a 12 value in hexadecimal format similarly suppose see here uh, suppose we have to change the value that is suppose 3 okay sum equal to 3 plus 2 just uh, save this again file 3 plus 2 equal to 5 right build all build succeeded then goes to debugger select tool mplab same then view special function register click on f9 f9 after that just stop the particular running execution so click on f5 here okay so after stop the execution see here where is port d c port d is equal to 0 x 0 5 so this is our program okay 3 plus 2 equal to 5 means 5 value stored into the sum and sum value is stored into the port d see here port d is equal to 5 so in this way you can take here another values and also choose another port also mention here port b and trace b registers anything as per your requirement so this is a complete execution of simple addition of two numbers in embedded c programming language thank you